This product is really hard to find nowadays, but let's see if we can pull a Leon Dreisaitl. Welcome back everyone. Take a look at this. I've got a 1415 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey Hobby Box and I'm so excited to open this one up. I did open up a box of this stuff last summer and it was an awesome box. Got a Johnny Goudreau Young Guns Canvas and I'm just super excited to open it up again. Here are the odds on the back and with this being a hobby box we're gonna get six Young Guns. Hopefully one of those can be Leon Dreisaitl because, yeah, that has really skyrocketed in price and, uh, I mean, it's such an awesome card. So, this is a super awesome opening. I hope you will enjoy it and hopefully I can pull something awesome. Let's get right into this box. Okay, so I destroyed the box, as I so often do. But uh, here we go. This is the box 1415 Series 1 Hobby. This is awesome. We've got 24 packs in here, and there are 8 cards in every pack. And so this should be an amazing opening. Definitely going to be a bit of a longer one. And hopefully we can also pull some awesome hobby exclusive hits. That would be phenomenal. And I'll just get the packs out of the box before we start everything off. And yeah, so the best young guns in this class would be... Definitely the Leon Dreisaitl. Johnny Goudreau is a good one. I guess the Evgeny Kuznetsov could be the third best, but we're really hoping for a Dreisaitl here, so that is the goal. Hopefully we can get one, and I would not mind an amazing hobby exclusive hit. That would be amazing. So we've got Jonathan Taves on the front end. This is a really nice looking pack for sure. The product in general just looks amazing. This was the 25th anniversary of Upper Deck, and here are the odds on the back. So there are definitely some amazing cards to find. I believe there are some 25th anniversary buybacks as well. So, I mean, this is going to be really awesome, and I'm going to quit stalling and just jump right into the first pack hope for something amazing I opened a lot of this back in the day and uh, I mean hopefully we can get something awesome the series 2 cards for 1415 are so impossible to find nowadays and I mean it's a bit of a shame because I would have really liked to open up a box but I've been looking for quite some time and I've never been able to find one so anyways let's get right into this we've got Tyler Johnson these are the base cards Pretty spectacular looking in my opinion, very much like 1718. And we've got Ryan Getzlaff and then Tommy Wingles. And our first insert is a Shining Stars blue parallel of Jonathan Tays. A center Shining Stars, very nice for the Chicago Blackhawks. And I guess I'll put the inserts in the middle. Don't usually do that. Carter Hutton, Alex Killorn, and Cam Fowler. Oh, and actually Jason Demers in the back. All right, so second pack. Let's go top right this time. This is an awesome product for sure. It definitely would be awesome to get a dry settle. And actually, back in 1415, UD game jerseys were one in 12 packs in at least the hobby packs. So we are going to get two in this box. Actually, we could even get a UD game patch. So that would be pretty sweet. Brandon Dubinsky, Ryan Suter, Brad Marchand, Chris Versteeg, and oh, we got an autograph. And it's Ryan Murphy, Signature Sensations. Oh, very nice. A sticker auto of Ryan Murphy. That's pretty cool. Signature Sensations. These are case hits, so one in 288 packs. And wow, that's a very nice card. Good way to start things off. I'm a fan of that. We got Carl Soderberg and then Marcus Kruger. And finally, Travis Hamannick. All right, that's a good hit for sure. Now let's go bottom left. Still no Young Guns in this box. The cards are really sticky in 1415. At least, maybe not in this pack, but most of the packs, they seem to be Mike Fisher, Andre Palat, Cal Clutterbuck, and maybe, nope, nothing stuck behind. And then Ryan Garbutt, Jay Bomeister, Wayne Simmons, Mike Green, and Matt Cullen. All base. That's pretty rare to get an all base pack. I guess you used to get a few in 1415, but nowadays you don't really see base packs in series one and two, or if you do, they're very, very rare. So you also did get a guaranteed exclusives parallel per box back in 1415. Now they aren't guaranteed, but uh, well, at least it's either a guaranteed exclusive or high gloss parallel, or even a young gun exclusive or high gloss. So Pascal Zupri, Andre Markov, Dennis Seidenberg, and our first young gun is Yuri Sikash. Very nice for the Montreal Canadiens. This is like, I guess my third one of his 
That's an awesome card. I remember really chasing this one back in 1415. Ryan O'Reilly, Rob Klinkhammer, Chris Kunitz, and Brendan Gallagher. All right, back to the top left we go. Come on, let's hit something amazing. That would be so awesome. And no jersey in here. We're going to know when we get our first jersey because the pack is definitely going to be thicker. So Jacob Chuba, Oli Mata, and there we go. <laughs> this is the stickiness I was talking about. Josh Bailey, Tori Krug, and a Steven Stamkos. Shining Stars. This is the regular Shining Stars. Another center we got here. And then we have Evander Kane, Chris Letang, and Brock Nelson. So I do hope because we got Seacash that uh, we still have the chance at the Leon Dreisaitl. When I got Yuri Seacash in my tin, I think I got the Sam Reinhardt Young Guns. So maybe we're going to get a Reinhardt in here. And yeah, I got no idea. I'm going to have to see. We have another Young Guns coming up. Darcy Kemper, Patrick Weirkosh, and Jonas Enroth. And very nice first overall pick back in 2014. Aaron Ekblad Young Guns. That's a nice card. Very nice. That's a good one to get. Not as good as the dry settle, but still nice. Craig Anderson, Mark Giordano, Andrew Fierens, and Milan McCulloch. All right, I guess we're going to go bottom left this time. Not a bad start for sure. And uh, seems like, oh, yes, Young Guns, high gloss, maybe exclusives. I don't know, something gold. I've actually never pulled an exclusive or high gloss Young Gun in the past. So this is a first. Jeff Carter, Ryan Ellis, Mark Letestu, Alexander Semin. And we have Christian Folin. That's awesome. Young Guns UD Exclusives, number 70 of 100. And that's pretty awesome because he, I believe, is still with the Montreal Canadiens organization. That's an awesome hit. Look at that. Gold Foil Young Guns, numbered 70 out of 100. That's my first ever exclusive Young Guns. I will take that. Beautiful. So we got a Young Guns exclusive and an autograph in this box already. Definitely looking good. And a first overall pick, Young Guns. JVR, Thomas Hickey, and Rich Peverly. All right, let's go bottom right. So back in 1415, uh, there weren't any of the clear cuts in uh, Series 1 and 2. So that came later on. And I don't think we have a jersey in here. Barkov, Hoodler, Eric Carlson, and a Yarmir Jager. Hockey Heroes 2000s. Very nice. Okay, and that exclusives actually does not count as a young gun. So that's pretty awesome. Krejci, Pearson, Monahan, and Kyle Turris. So eight packs down. I believe 16 to go if my, if my math is correct. So let's keep on going. And I don't know what we have here. Something different, it seems. Matt Carl, Zach Cassian, TJ Oshi, Derek Brassard, and seems like another all base pack. Dougie Hamilton, Radko Gudis, Kevin Bieksa, and Jaden Schwartz. All right, so I guess that definitely does happen back in 1415. A few base packs per box, but that's all right. Definitely an awesome start so far. And sorry about hitting the stand there. Definitely have a tendency to do that, and uh, I think we got another Hockey Heroes here. So, Jeff Petrie, Bobby Ryan, Ben Scrivens, and, oh, I guess this is the Checklist Hockey Heroes. Wow, that's pretty cool. Never seen that before. They're very nice. That's a pretty cool card for sure. And then we have Jordan Eberle, and then Eric Goodbranson, Damian Brunner, and Mikael Bournival. Very nice. So I guess we can hope for a Young Guns canvas as well. Those are 1 in 48 packs. And we've got our first jersey coming up. So Jonas Brodin, Andrew Cogliano, and oh wow, we got the all-star. Danny Heatley. This is a Team Canada jersey. Tiny little jersey back in 1415, but that's a pretty awesome card being a Team Canada jersey. That is awesome. Danny Heatley. Definitely an awesome card. Wow. Mike Richards, Yaramir Yager, and Jack Johnson. All right, let's go bottom right. Very cool card to, uh, wow, that's awesome. And uh, that means we're going to get three hits in this box, two jerseys and uh, one auto, which is pretty sweet. And I guess we got another blue Shining Stars coming up. Travis Zajac, John Gibson, Ryan McDonough, Alex Edler, and Patrick Kane. Let's go. Patrick Kane, Shining Stars Blue, the other Blackhawk. Very nice. And then we have Lori Korpikoski, Merrick Zidlicki, and Henrik Lundqvist. Halfway through this box, definitely a solid box so far. Three young guns down, I believe. So we've got Semyon Varlamov, Paul Martin, 
Mike Smith and Alexander Koklachev, Young Guns. He was supposed to be spectacular, and uh, yep, that kind of flopped. There you go, Koklachev, Young Guns, and then Rick Nash, and Ryan Johansson, Jeff Zatkoff, and Milan Lucic. Okay, keep on going. This one feels a little thicker, but no, doesn't seem like uh, I've got a jersey here. Uh, yeah, very interesting. Matt Cook, Eric Jelena, Alex Galchenyuk, and then Sergey Bobrovsky, and a Timu Solani. This is a very nice Shining Stars. Regular Shining Stars for the Ducks. And then Tyler Sagan, Joe Colborn, and Seth Jones. And that is a second year card for the Jones. Very nice box so far. Let's keep this going. Wow, come on, let's hit something else amazing. Good Young Guns would be pretty sweet. We've got another Young Guns coming up. We've got Tyler Ennis, Dustin Bufflin, Pekka Rene, and Andre Nestrazil. I saw this one coming because uh, we got the Yuri Sikach. So Andre Nestrazil, Young Guns, and then Justin Falk, Jared Spurgeon, and Kyle Palmieri, and Zemgis Gergensens. All right, nine packs to go. I believe one more jersey and maybe a few canvas cards, hopefully a Young Guns canvas, and then maybe two more Young Guns. Not quite sure. Let's see what we have here. Steven Stamkos, Brad Boys, Jonathan Bernier, Shane Doan, and a Brendan Gallagher UD canvas. That's a nice card. Wow, and then holding up the torch in the back. I really like that. Eddie Lack, Valtteri Filpula, and Thomas Fleischmann. All right, only eight packs to go. Come on get something awesome so I believe two canvas cards to go two young guns probably one jersey and then maybe a mix of other things maybe another shining stars let's see we have another canvas coming I think so a checklist for UD series one Tyler Bozak Jarrett Stoll and very nice young guns canvas of Vladislav Nemesnikov that's a good one to get Nemesnikov definitely a decent player I believe he's with the Colorado now so there you go I believe we're gonna get eight young guns in this box the checklist Joffrey Lupul Jonathan Quick and then Matt Reed so I mean definitely a solid box nothing exceptional so far but a lot of quality cards and hopefully maybe we can get something amazing here in the last few packs but I really can't complain if we don't still an awesome box TJ Brody Roman Yossi Nick Cronwall Nathan McKinnon, and a Antti Niemi UD Canvas. Another goalie who eventually played with Montreal. Henrik Zetterberg, and then Jamie McGinn, and Vlad Tarasenko. Second year card. All right, let's go. Come on, one jersey left. Maybe it can be a patch. That would be pretty sweet. We've got Ray Emery, rest in peace, Sean Horkoff, Dion Phaneuf, and our last canvas, I guess, of Marianne Gabryk. For the LA Kings. Very nice. Mark Shifley, Philippe Forsberg, Evgeny Malkin, and Colton Sevier. All right, five packs to go in here. Come on. Let's get something awesome. The patch would be sensational to uh, add on to the amazing haul we've already gotten. I do believe we're going to get these Sam Reinhardt Young Guns. And speaking of Young Guns, we've got one coming up right here Johan Franzen, Patrick Sharp, Kerry Price, and there you go. Speak of the devil, Sam Reinhardt. Young Guns rookie. That's a decent Young Guns for sure in this crop. And then David Clarkson, Antoine Vermette, Pavel Datsyuk, and Jonathan Taves. All right, four packs to go. So I believe one Young Guns probably left and then a jersey, hopefully a patch. That would be better than the jersey. Nope, seems like we do have a jersey here and it's in this pack. Let's see if we can get something awesome like that Danny Heatley one. We've got uh, Mark Streit, and cards are sticky. Curtis Glencross, and I completely spoiled it, but that is a sick one. Joe Sackick, UD Game Jersey. There you go. Another legend right here. Joe Sackick, UD Game Jersey. I will take that. Jeff Skinner, Nick Foligno, and Nino Niederreiter. My voice is completely dying on me right now. So it's a good thing we only have a few packs to go. And uh, let's see what we can get. Another Young Guns coming up. Vladimir Sobotka, Alex Goligoski, Alex Ovechkin, and Scott Mayfield, Young Guns. All right. Not the biggest name, of course, but uh, still decent. Cody Eakin, Joel Ward, Matt Nieto, and Logan Couture. All right. Two packs left. Maybe another Young Guns? I'm not quite sure. We've had so many. And uh, seems like a Shining Stars, I believe. So Marian Hosa, Yuri Tlusti, Danny DeKaiser. Jacob Silverberg and Corey Perry. 
Shining Stars. This is the regular Shining Stars once again. And then we have Morgan Riley, Brent Seabrook, and Anton Hudobin. Last pack. Come on, let's get some last pack mojo. Wouldn't mind hitting a uh, dry sidle here in the final pack. That would be absolutely sensational. And seems like an all base pack to finish things off. Max Pacioretty, Anton Belov, Matt Duchesne, Martin Hansel, Jimmy Howard, and then Hampus Lindholm. David Dernay and Brian Campbell. So there you go. I really can't complain about this box. It was definitely solid. Let's jump into the insert recap. Okay, so this was definitely a very solid opening. This is the insert recap. Let's go. We got a couple hockey heroes. I believe this is the checklist. And then Yarmir Jager with the New York Rangers. Jonathan Taves, Shining Stars Blue. Steven Stamkos, Shining Stars. Patty Kane, Blue Shining Stars. Timu Solani, Shining Stars, Corey Perry, one of those as well. Brendan Gallagher, UD Canvas, as well as Antti Niemi. Also got a Marianne Gabrick one. And then the bigger hits in this break got a Team Canada UD game jersey of Danny Heatley. And then a Joe Sackick UD game jersey, a Yuri Sekash, Young Guns, Alexander Koklachev, Young Guns, Andre Nestrazil as well as Scott Mayfield, and then the better hits, we got an Aaron Ekblad, first overall pick, Young Guns, a Sam Reinhardt one, and then a Ryan Murphy Signature Sensations autograph, sticker auto, this is a case hit, very nice card, and then my first ever Young Guns exclusive poll, Christian Follain numbered 70 out of 100, and finally also got an 8th Young Gun, Vladislav Nemesnikov, Young Guns Canvas. My voice has absolutely given up on me, but this was an awesome opening. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, if you could give me a thumbs up, that would really make my day. And if you could subscribe down below, I post some hockey card content very often. I hope to share some more creative ideas with all of you in the future. This was a super fun break. I really hope you enjoyed it. And as always, I hope to see you all next time.